Okay, okay, okay. Trey six hundo. Three six double O. Trey six hundred with a niggas who run it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Trey six hundo. Three six double O. Trey six hundo. Three six double O. It's your boy. Track 600 Quentin TV. We back again with another one. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Hit that notification bell. Shout out to the notification family. Salute to all my new subscribers and all my day ones. I do this for y'all. Let's get it. Hey, man. Say, man. Today's story is coming all the way from Fort Worth, Texas. It's story time with OG Percy. Hey, he's breaking down how he met a female and she moved from one situation to another situation and she still was down. Just because she felt like she wasn't where she needed to be. But he just was breaking down the situation like, hey, we we all, as long as we we're trying to evolve, as long as we all trying to get to the next spot, then we good. And we should just not complain about that because if, if, hey, if he can complain, then everybody can complain. We have a whole lot of things to complain about. But, hey, hey, we going with the positive note with the vibes, man. Y'all let me know what y'all think about this whole situation. It's your boy Tracy. It's on the TV. I'm out. Let's go. You get up, you answer the phone, you go see who it is calling the ring ring, you hear him calling, you just let the phone ring. Y'all can look at a person, you know what I'm saying? Um, no, I, I heard a lady complaining about a situation that she was in. She said, um, you know, um, she feel like she 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 just losing. She just doing bad. She feel like everything is just going the wrong way and the wrong this. That's what she tell me. And I'm listening to her. You know, she said she moved from um, Compton. Uh, she come off of Pyro Street. You dig what I'm saying? I'm like, damn. You know, she moved out of a bad situation, moved all the way down here to Texas, and got us, you know, doing something different. And she was, you know, telling me everything that was wrong. You know, I'm, I'm still listening to her. She said, I came down here. I know I, I I'm going to um, Mastermind School. You know, I said, God damn. You know, you no know, big, big, big things. You know, and she, I'm sitting there listening to, him, you know, it, 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 but but you know, she was filing a complaint. She was filing a complaint. You did what I'm saying, and the complaint was, you know, uh, you know, I, I, I don't, I don't think I'm where I should be. I, I said, look at it, little mom, hold on, right, please hold on, stay right there. And I looked and I told him, man, yeah. The situation you just came out of, you know, the, the, the place you grew up in, Pyro Street, you know, the shit that you had to endure coming up in a, in a, in a, in a real a real hood environment, and, and to say everything that you say that you're doing right now, you understand me? And uh, There's no room for complaint. You should be patting yourself on the back, telling God, thank you. Nigga, I'm doing way better than you feeling, little mama. You feeling like ain't nothing going on. You're doing way better than you feeling. You name all this that you got, all this that you got going on, and you found some room in there to complain about your life when you know people that still where you at. You know people that still stuck in the same mentality, the mind state, the poverty, the poorness, they got to wake up and don't got and got to feed for this and fish for that and hustle. And, and you talking about you going to mastermind school. You got out of this situation. You was able to up and move away from the situation, baby. You're doing way better than you think, man. You're doing better than you're feeling, little mama. I know it feel like you ain't got... Look at me. I can find room. If I find room to complain, I'd be a damn fool. You know why I'd be a damn fool? Because I know what I came from. Hello! I can't find room to complain because I know where I came from. When you know where you came from and you know what God and bless you with, come on, man, you're going to say, hey... I heard what I said on the thing. He's worth, he's done miracles on me. See, I'm the type of person that can get up and tell God thank you every Sunday. But I talk to him every day. He's the first man. My family know that God is my weed. God is my morning coffee. I don't talk to nobody unless I done had God every morning. Every morning. Uh, the devil can't do nothing to me. The devil can't put his hand. He can't sit, say, man, I've been fighting that nigga for years now. I can see, you know what I know what um that what's come on God, talk God. Now I can see evil in its, you know, physical form now. You know, I I used to just have to wait on, you know, find out who didn't like, you know, the bullshit to jump out. You dig what I'm saying? But now I can see um 
I can see you know, enemies in their physical form now. When I used to conceal them. So, you know, one thing, and I still, it's still some bad ones, but God knows that I know how to fight in the spiritual realm now. I know how to fight the unseen. I know how to fight what I can't see. You can't see the evil that comes up on you within another person. You can't see how a demon can jump out of one person into another person and jump out of another person. You can't see that. And if I told you I can see that, you would think that I'm the crazy one. Y'all just call me the crazy one then. Because I can recognize Satan every time he appears. I can recognize the devil every time he sent one of his little weak ass um, warriors, um, demons, or little devils, or little witches, or little warlocks, you know, to come try to get in on a, on a real one. Uh, my hardest fight one in the streets. My hardest fight was not in a human flesh. Anybody in human flesh, in human form, you use my least weary. <laughs> Look at me. <laughs> my least weary. You Come on, quit playing with us. Okay, okay, okay. Trey Six Hundo. Three Six Double O. Let's go, y'all. Y'all know what's going on, man. We need that drop, man. We trying to get a 25K, y'all. We, we, we trying to push. Before this year, we trying to reach, you know, reach our quarter at 25K. We going to give y'all the best, man. Uh, right. All the best. We coming at y'all like this every week so y'all can't uh, be behind or be misled. Goddamn me. Uh, only thing on here is good food, man. We feed, man. We trying to get uh, food for thought, man.